My name is Ryan Capecci. I live in Lafayette, Indiana with my wife Lily, our five-year-old son John, and our three-year-old son Eli that has Down syndrome. Hi, I'm Renee Petrie. I'm the Lafayette Area Coordinator for Down Syndrome Indiana Lafayette, and I am married to my husband John. We have two children, Ben, who is 15, and our daughter Caroline, who is almost 12, and she is our kiddo with an extra chromosome who has Down syndrome. On March 21st, 2015, I decided to take our older son, John, out for ice cream at a local shop called Silver Dipper. Uh, we went with a friend of ours, Austin, and as we checked out at the ice cream shop, they said it was cash only, and neither Austin or I had any cash. March 21st, 2015 was World Down Syndrome Day, and our family had gone to Indianapolis that day to the Cheesecake Factory, and we decided it was going to be fun to do some random acts of kindness that Down Syndrome Indiana had given out cards to share with individuals, and we ended up tipping our waitress $21 that day for the Cheesecake Factory, and then later that evening, my husband and I had a date night, just ourselves, and we'd gone to dinner, and decided to go across the street to Silver Dipper, which was not the usual ice ice cream place we go to. As Austin and I were trying to figure out how we, we were going to pay for the ice cream, a lady behind us stood up and offered to pay for the ice cream and said that it was World Down Syndrome Day and they wanted to do an act of kindness by buying our ice cream for us. And that's how we met Renee Petrie, who ended up being the community group leader for Down Syndrome Indiana Lafayette. And that brought us into the group. So we were eating ice cream at Silver Dipper, and at the time, Silver Dipper only accepted cash. And we see two um, younger guys in their 20s and a little boy, about three, um, getting ice cream. They'd ordered um, several items, and they go to pay, and um, they were asked to pay with cash. And apparently, they didn't have any. They're searching their pockets. They don't have any. And you could tell they didn't know what to do. Well, we still had our random acts of kindness cards. And so I grabbed one of them and I walked over to them and I said, hey, let us pay for it. It's World Down Syndrome Day and our daughter has Down Syndrome. And the man, Austin, looks at my husband and I and says, oh my gosh, Ryan and his wife just had a baby a few weeks ago that has Down Syndrome. What are the odds? <laughs> so it was such a great day to be able to experience that with them. Please consider donating today to support Down Syndrome Indiana Lafayette as we work towards getting a location. A private area to meet with families who have just had a diagnosis of Down Syndrome. Programs such as the learning program that helps with literacy skills for our kiddos with Down Syndrome to be able to host uh, events such as our winter party, um, picnics for families, as well as self-advocacy um, programming for our adults with Down syndrome. To have a location would be huge for our organization and we really, really want to be able to focus and work towards that and we need your help to do it.